It's President Nora again, and we've just hung a new show. It's called The Orr Street Artists. These are mainly people I knew when I was going to school in Columbia, and now there is a group of studios called The Orr Street Studios, and some of the artists who work there are represented here. Um, I'm gonna start with Jane Mudd. She was getting her master's when I was getting my bachelor's and she taught at William Woods in Fulton for quite a few years. She's just retired. This is, I believe, on her own farm, a meadow that she and her husband planted. Here are five works by Nancy Katzman, who was going to school at the same time I was. And her work is, um, she has a real interest in small, repetitive lines. She often works very small, not always. Um, I think she's interested in artists like Clay. And also, I know she really likes Rose Katz, who drew a cartoonist for The New Yorker who has a very interesting line to her work. There's a couple of etchings by Frank Stack, who is a professor at MU and who is a friend to a lot of people at Orr Street. He had a studio there for years. This is by Byron Smith. He was working at MU and taking classes at the same time. He just is retiring this year. And he, he and Frank did a lot of painting trips together. Here's an oil by Frank. He did quite a few figure drawings that belongs to me. And this is another piece by Nancy Katzman. that I own. Here's four paintings by Michelle Seat, who was the president or the head of uh, Orr Street Studios until recently. Now Jane Mudd is. There's uh, the uh, trailhead at Roachfort. This is an abstract of the Finger Lakes. Um, this one's Bear Springs. I'm not sure where that is. And just Autumn. Painting. Here's five pieces by Martha Daniels. She worked, I think she has just retired from the conservation department. And I think she and Jane like to go out and work on site a lot. She's very interested in wildflowers and trees. Here's a little painting by her of a bison. And this is a painting that I own of Byron Smith. I hope he makes it up to the reception. He might be surprised to see it. It's, <laughs> I bought it a really long time ago. Here's another um, painting by Byron. There's quite a few Missouri River scenes among my friends from there. This is by Byron. This is another one by Frank Stack. Both watercolors. Here's a watercolor by Byron called Eagle Bluffs. And this is, I believe, on the Katy Trail. This is by Byron. An oil really beautiful subtle colors and he's doing a lot of scratching in to get some of those white branches um i think this is called is that cooper's landing i believe it's very soft very uh atmospheric this is a uh, ghost ranch which is where georgia o'keefe lived he, Byron took a trip out to New Mexico at some point. Really beautiful little watercolor. And here are four more by Jane Mudd. 
This is Marceline. Not she didn't do it this year. One year at the pay now. Here's a levy. I'm not sure. Probably down near the Missouri. Uh, that's a painting I own. Another painting of the river. And I'm not sure where this one, the streets, a uh, little town scene. She looks like she's up on a hill. I'm betting it's Fulton. And that's the show. Uh, we have a reception at an unusual time this month. It's going to be on a Monday because that was the only time all of them could make it. It's going to be 5 to 7, Monday the 12th, or yeah, September 12th. And I hope as many people as possible can make it to it because it's always difficult when you're from out of town and no one knows you. So please come to the reception if you can.